in Dallas, Texas, drinking sodium fluoridated water. All the scientific studies show my IQ has been reduced by at least 20 points. But hopefully, and most wisely of all, is peaceful protest. Soft power is the strongest of all. That's the essence of Oriental wisdom. Conspiracy people, I have a word to say to you guys too, okay? It's easy to criticize someone for spilling a glass of milk. It's much harder to put the milk back in the glass. So it's fine to criticize and it's great, but you've got to spend a little bit more energy and time coming up with alternatives. If you want to really get the power, you have to come up with a better plan, not just criticize the plan that's going on now. Bounds from hell tonight. My uncle had told me this story a couple of years ago, and I didn't believe him. Like one of your listeners who discounted the story as nothing more than just a religious newspaper fabricated account. The story about the digging of the hole and the hearing of the sounds from hell is very real. It did occur in Siberia. My uncle collected videos and audio tapes and so forth on the paranormal, supernatural. He passed away fairly recently. But he would have loved your show. He let me listen to one of the audio tapes that he had on the sounds from hell in Siberia, and I copied it. He received his copy from a friend who worked at the BBC. It took me a while to find it tonight, but attached is that sound from my uncle's tapes. It's not the greatest quality, but the sounds are there. I was very hesitant to send you this, as the sound bothers me to listen to. I'd suggest that if you do play it on the program, warn listeners in advance so they may have the option of turning the radio off for 30 seconds while it plays. What you are about to hear is very disturbing indeed. Indeed. <laughs> 